Hello everyone! Today I will show you how to use Canva to create a postcard. What's interesting about Canva is that you can get verified to get Canva for education for free. School service centers can have their domain name verified for their whole staff all at once. To create your postcard, you will first visit canva.com. I am personally signed up with my uh, professional email from my school service center. What I like about Canva is that there are already a ton of designs and models available. So I will write postcard and search for the postcards templates that are already uh, available for me. So there are different ones. So if you click or if you scroll over the different images, you will see the second page of the postcard as well. And you can choose the one that you like the most. I will choose this one. There you go. So I will customize this template. So this one is about uh, South Korea. I will do mine just to show you. I will do mine about Australia. So I can first erase whatever was here already. I could also start with a blank template if I wanted to, but I really like starting with one of their models because they have so many. So basically on the left hand side, you have all the elements that you would want to include in your postcard. So, so I would like to see what image they have about Australia. So here I'll put the little kangaroo here. I'll change this for this. I could insert maybe a picture like this. Or maybe I don't want to have the, the one that was there. I want to have my kangaroo over. So forward like this. I see my font is a little dark. So if I click on my font, I'll have this tool here appear. And I can choose the color of the text. So this is better. I'll put my kangaroo over here. So this is my first page. Then if I look at my second page, I can do the same thing. I can remove what over here. I can decide that I want to see only graphics, only photos, maybe videos if there are some. So I could include a video of my kangaroo to make it an interactive postcard. Just like so, here, like this. If I have a, a picture that I would like to use that is on my computer or Chromebook, I can come here and upload and upload my own file if I needed to. All the, the font tools are right here. If I want to add a text box or some cool fonts right here. Then when I'm ready to share with my teacher, my postcard, I can click on share. Google Classroom is, um, is in here. So you could just click on classroom and send it back to your classroom. Same for Teams. Or you can send your teacher the link to this postcard. Or one last option is you could download it. This one says video because of my kangaroos, but it could also be an, as an image or a PDF. I could download it and then share it with my teacher. So I hope this was useful. 